Hey, good Saturday to you. It's uh, what is it, June 6th? It's June 6th. Yeah, I want to show you this. Uh, look at this. You got this strawberry plant it's starting to run her. There's my strawberries up here. I got uh, I got one coming on here. I got this runner, and right here, I can focus in on that. Right here, it's gonna start uh, sprouting. So I'm gonna take that runner. Let's see if I can climb up here a little bit higher. It goes back all the way back to the base. Oh, sorry. Let's see if I can get that. Won't really focus in on the base there. It goes all the way down into the base. Follow it out here to my hand. And right here, down in here, it's gonna root. So I'm gonna snip that off and see if I can start a new cutting. So we'll cut that there and then we'll cut this back. It doesn't need to be there. <laughs> All right, let's take that into the greenhouse and start a cutting. We're bellied up to the bar here, a dick. It's not just a picture. It's real life. It's real. It's, this is us. This is us. Okay, we're in the greenhouse finally. It's nice and dry. It's rainy. Rainy Saturday, June 6th. Rainy Saturday. I uh, got my cutting for my strawberry. We're going to trim that down right to show you this see that that's a node that's called a node right there it's just a joint where the new growth is coming on i'm gonna snip it right there now for the medium i just have this uh this is just bark shavings I go down to my local uh, supplier and they fill me up a truckload of bark and it goes around in your in your yard, makes your uh, yard nice and mulched. Fill up my my pot here. Reuse this pot from a planting that I bought. A little petunia or tomato, forget what it was, and. Uh, First thing we're gonna do, we're gonna water this in really well. Really well. So I'll put my cutting down here. And this this bark material is very porous. So water's gonna go right through it. It's gonna stay moist, but it's not gonna be soggy. You can see it's just running, running right through it. So we'll give it a good dousing. over here right there now I think I bought this at Home Depot or Lowe's big box store uh, it's just rooting hormone it's white powder rooting hormone dip your rooting in it stick it in your in your medium, your soil medium. I am, you see this little leaf, this little leaflet that's on here. I'm gonna rip that off, just like that. That right there, that little spot there is gonna aid. I can bury it up to about, oh, about two inches. I'm gonna bury that thing in. So I'm just gonna dip that down just on the Right on the base, that's where the roots are gonna come out. That's all you need, right there. And we're gonna stick that. Right 
right down inside there. There you go. You don't really need any more water. Put a little bit on there. And this will just go on the tray so it doesn't drip down. Let me show you my greenhouse. Well, I hope you guys have been following along. This is a new addition. You see my vertical my vertical fence boards here that I I put in. They are uh, quite the addition, I think. It's going to add a little bit something extra. My lemon tree is doing really well. I got that in a bag. My tomatoes in a bag. Just just got a pumpkin started right here. That's a pumpkin for October. Got some tomatoes and they are strung with string all the way up about eight eight feet up there and and uh branch these ones off into a V. So we got two uh two liters running and they're doing pretty good. I got some got some flowers coming on. Got some more tomatoes over here and uh peppers. Just took the tops off these peppers. Took the tops off. We're in, we are down to uh about seven, six, seven, maybe eight, eight leaves. And I have three plants in this. I just wrapped it with some landscape fabric and filled it up with some dirt. There's a little bit of little bit of bark on top. It's not very deep. It's just a, a little bit extra there. Most of this stuff is just cuttings. These roses. These are roses that I took from my sister's house. I took I took about that much off. I just went to her house and I liked the flower, so I cut it off and put it in the rooting hormone, just like I showed you. And uh show you what else I got going on here. A lot of rhododendrons. Um, a lot of azaleas, got some blueberries coming on. Um, I watched this guy. Let me set you guys back up here. Let me set you guys back up here. I watched this guy called Mike Kincaid. Look him up. Mike Kincaid with a K. Um, he does a lot of rootings, rootings of uh, rhododendrons, azaleas, um, things like that. But he does petunias too. I've done quite a few p petunias. You know, like this guy here. This is a cutting I took off of a, a plant, just a wave petunia. Uh, started a flower. But um, Mike Kincaid, man, I've learned a lot from him. He's He is spot on. So I, uh, I follow Mike, he's a great guy. Follow him if you want to know about cuttings. That guy is the master cutter, I tell you. Uh, I just grabbed a few of these guys for my hanging baskets. And I have these growing. I have these growing in my, uh, on my property. But uh, they have a few roots on them down in here. And I'm just going to put them in my baskets and see if they will uh, supply me with a little, just a very variegation irrigation yeah got my lavender let me show you my plants over here what i have growing past this lavender i took this this lavender here i just bought it at the gro this is a grocery store it's four dollars for basic lavender it doesn't even tell you what kind it is you know, what the variety is just lavender huh <laughs> and uh i got some cuttings coming on more more cuttings over here there's a bunch these these cuttings came from the same plant they're starting to flower they're starting to flower here I should take you uh take you over let me set you back up let's go look at these these been uh root i put these cuttings in here about two weeks ago let's just pop this up oh look at that so we got some roots, roots growing. I think I have, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight plants. I think I'll just plug it in as one. We'll call it one. Well, 
happy gardening to you guys. Stay safe out there and uh, garden on. <laughs> ah.